No, for sure, for sure. Chilling, taking it easy. Here, we've got a bit of a Guelph team kill coming in here. We got Father Plum taking on Nesty. Ooh, just in time. Pardon me? Just in time. Though. Just in time, yeah, the set's just starting. This is, uh, I think, number three versus number five All of right. Guelph PR, so Father Plum being number three. Gotcha. But uh, both of them, phenomenal. Yeah, she saw Plum play last, uh, two weeks ago. Yeah, Plum is, Plum is sweet. I don't and think I've ever taken a set off Plum in this game. All right, Ooh. we got the Zare Luke's coming in here. Ooh. Looking nice. Big damage. Oh, speaking of damage. Damn, I didn't even want that killed. I, I, that was 60%. 60 to 93 after hit, and the, the knockback was nuts. She's PK Thunder 2, everybody. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, back throw. Get him off the... That's the fun way back though. Makes it. Yeah. Oh my goodness. And has a stage control now. Switching up the, uh, the ledge guarding here. Ooh. Plum answering right back though. Good up beat. I can't uh, cover ledge there. But wasn't enough. Cover next to you. Very good. I always find Lucas and Ness players are always so good at recovering. Oh yeah, you gotta be like with that with a recovery that's like exploitable like that. They yeah, they definitely got another stuff for sure. Goodness. Oh. <laughs> Synchronized. <laughs> I, that, that was. I, I, that reminded me of uh, that one uh, clip where four Meta Knights in Brawl were all doing the tornado. Oh yeah, you know I, I've seen that one. I, that, that clip was great, and they're all doing something different too. Yeah. All trying to cover. Oh. A snipe, okay. All right. I, I, side B, I guess, can take stocks off. Let's, I guess he was at 130, right? Yeah, for sure. Okay, right. makes sense. Plum trying to follow up there with the forwarder. Not quite going to connect. Down tilt on shield. Let's see, looking for the edge guard here. Backs off, though, a little bit. Surprise gave Plum, uh, Father Plum, some space. There we go. Nair off stage. Just trying to get. Ooh, if Plum comes back. Yeah, I think he's gonna be uh, fishing for a grab. Nesty, that is. See if he gets one. Oh, that was it. Oh. There it is. Oh, up smash out of shield works too. Why not? Uh, it, it does the job. <laughs> Nesty still off a stock though. After yeah. that uh, PK thunder kill. Plum looking for that PK fire. Uh, to, eat, to get some uh, HP back. But doesn't. Uh, here we go. Yeah. Up tilt out of shield there. Not exactly the fastest option, but still worked. Ooh, Nesty trying to catch the PK freeze. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, just, yeah, Nesty really kind of just struggling here. Defensively trying to get anything going. Ooh, yeah. The snipe, the side that he wants to get taking that stock. Absolutely, momentum just... swinging back into Plum's favor here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the, the, the second interaction like that in this game, but <laughs> they were accomplishing different things, I cannot lie. Yeah. Ooh, the Zare loops. Ooh, it's gonna be some good uh, damage recovery there. For an ST, still up by about 50%. They're both trying to bait each other to use, just like that, they're trying to bait each other to use projectiles. Yeah. A bit too much, but because PK Fire is generally is very good on both these characters. More so than Ness, I feel, it covers more angles, but. Yeah. Oh. Uh, as we've seen, actually, Plum, though, making use of Lucas' side just as well, if not better, with uh, those two kills, actually, with that. All right, we got the down air coming in here from Nessie. Trying to follow up with an up air, not quite going to do it. Looking maybe for an up smash or something out of shield, possibly a back throw. Both playing very, very careful here. Plum knows that any grab will be his demise. There we go, trying to safely build percent on Nesty here. Okay, we got an edge guard scenario here for Plum. Ooh, the side B to get him off stage again. Beautiful air dodge in the center stage there. And SD got stage control once again. But, oh! Up smash out of shield? Yeah. I didn't realize that's such a good option there for an SD, but wow. That's very fast. But can we can we get some uh, frame data on that? Yeah, honestly, I don't know. <laughs> that, that like a, looks like it's seven or eight frames, not even. <clears throat> Could be. That was quick. Could look it up, actually. I have the frame data up here. <laughs> Ooh, I'm curious okay. though. Definitely a good kill option. I, who knew it was a better out of shield option? <laughs> Ooh. I think the best one is uh, definitely Nair for sure, but... Yeah, actually, that's true. But Very in terms quick. of getting the kill, definitely, uh, up definitely smash, the up smash, yeah. yeah. Oh, do I still have this app? I don't even know if I do anymore. <laughs> oh, no, I do. All right. All right, we got some fact checks here. Yeah, let's see if uh, I as can we go into game it. two. 
Uh, back on battle. We got a battlefield now. Instead of small battlefield, we got a regular battlefield. Battlefield, but bigger. Up smash is a 10 frame startup. That seems way faster. Gonna be yeah. Honest. Pretty Ooh. quick. Ooh. Plum starting off strong here. Yeah. I see it taking that first game, but Plum is definitely giving him a run for his money. Ooh, just like that side magnet taking uh, some percent back. I, likewise. Yeah. Right back at you. I could do that too. <laughs> I find like Plum is really, really good on those stages that are like longer. He has a lot more time to think. He has a lot more time to sort of outthink his opponent. They're like PS2 and uh, I guess Kalos. Yeah, PS2, regard. Kalos, Town. I don't know if Town's a map on here that you can play on, but. Ooh. Oh, it's an untech or not tech, no tech. Oh, missed the throw. We got the read though, but didn't quite get the throw a bit early. Trying to go for a Zare kill. Zare confirm. All right. Oh, nice little cross up there. Ooh, with the parry. Tried to get another Zare out there to stuff the approach of Dusty, but Dusty too quick. It's weird when these guys edge guard each other. Like, you don't want to use a uh, PK fire or PK thunder or anything because they'll just absorb it. I feel like. Uh, yeah, it's just a little uh, rock paper scissors of what they're gonna do. It seems. So oh, nice see. Yeah. Possibly some good SDI there from Plum. I'm not sure. Ooh. Or maybe the move just doesn't connect well. I don't know. Uh, it, you have to be a bit uh, farther off stage. Ah, uh, okay. Ooh, there we go. <coughs> Try to go for down tilt, left tilt there to get the kill, but doesn't quite reach it. Alright, again, both players really, really high percent here. Really, who's gonna blink first? There we go. Right. Nice there at ledge there to get that stock by an ST. Club has gotta get this next stock here, the next couple percent here. Could be a big deficit. Nice there. Yeah, I don't think there's a jump here. There we go. Looks like that we're even again. Alright, we got an ST just throwing everything out at the ledge here. Maintaining that stage control, playing nice and smart. Nair out of shield is going to be stuffed. It seems a lower percent. They both really don't uh, go for uh, side magnet. There's no point, honestly. It makes yeah. sense because they don't uh, take their percentage back. I think uh, they take about six back. It's not a lot. Yeah. Yeah. And so it makes sense why they would just start going in at the early point of their stocks. Uh, it devolves into that. Yeah. Pretty. <laughs> yep. <Yeah. laughs> it's a lot of moves out of shield from these guys for sure, but. Ooh. Oh, there we go. Back there. Get him off stage. Plum looking to edge guard. Doesn't get the snipe. Side magnet takes it. Yeah, Nesty doing a really great job there. He's died quite a few times to the side B off stage. Ooh, is he too low? No, nice. Ooh, good recovery there for Plum. Good job. Nice and close to the edge there to get that uh, edge guard. That was quite kill. But that. Ooh, beautiful DI. Yeah, really, really good DI there from Plum for sure. Nesty trying to catch with the down smash. He's going to be met with a forward air from Plum. Ooh, right back at you with that Nair to get him on the other side. Dragon Ball battles right now, back and forth. Yeah, and again, just like first stock, both players are really, really high percent. Again, who's going to blink first? Ooh, and Nesty. So far, that. Nesty's up yeah. too low on that. <laughs> <laughs> both Nairs actually kept taking the stock here. But, uh, can Plum answer back here? Takes 10%. That's inconsequential at this point. Well, there we go. Nice. Ooh, it's a Zare. Doesn't get the dash attack follow up, though. SCDI'ing that away. Very smart. Again, really, really great footsies here from both players, using their uh, movements to their advantage to fade in and fade out. There we go. Uh, sweet spot fair. Takes the stock for Flom. Uh, still pretty even. Nessie, a little advantage here. Ooh, but Flom was looking to take that advantage back in his favor. Yep. There we go. Now we're dead even. Trading hits now. Yeah, a lot of these guys can't really get too much going at these percents now. Oh, oh, the Umbi doesn't quite come back there. Goodness me. This is right. <laughs> so back and forth right now. It's super back and forth. I feel like it's almost, yeah, it's almost like a mirror match here. All right. Didn't quite get much off that PK fire. Good SDI to get out of it. But plum. Who parries the Nair? Not going to get able to get much off it. Getting the dash attack. Following up with an up air. Good, good shield hold from Plum. Oh. Oh. 
Metal Budge a little too long there, but didn't actually get punished too hard for it. All right, Pong's got to be super, super careful. This is his last stock winner side. Nessie has to be just as careful, though. So they're not swinging back in any of their, uh, any, anyone's favor here. Oh, just like that. As I say that, Pong goes for the edge guard. Oh, oh I love the down smash option. Unfortunately, just a little bit off. Frames off. Ooh, doesn't quite hit the mark. Back back throw, wow, yeah. Baxter took that. That was quick. You know what? It's interesting. Nesty wins the first two uh, blinking matches, and Plum wins the last one. Yeah. Oh. Won wow. the battle, but not the war. And here we go, G uh, Game uh, 3 coming up. Not sure what they're going to ban. <laughs> I can't really hear. Uh... I wonder if they'll opt to run it back. It's a really good stage battlefield for both the characters. Yeah, it is. Uh, mainly, uh... oh, okay, go back to small battlefield. All right. Okay. Was that where they were on, small battlefield? They, they were, were on it in the first game, actually. Yeah, yeah. So, uh... Plum uh, died to an up B, unfortunately, early on. So right. we'll see if uh, Nesty can hopefully get a, a second game here on Small Battlefield. Not with the up B, but just generally. We'll see uh, what they can do here. Yep. This is uh, Nesty's, I guess, counter pick, so to speak. <laughs> we're getting started here. Game three. Where's quarters? All right, Nesty throwing out a lot of hitboxes here. <coughs> Goodness. Good up smash. Fine, that's T. That frame 10 up smash. We know what that is now. Oh, yeah, now we do. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, that's what we're using those double jump cancels. Very, very, very All well. Right. Plum doing a great job fighting out of the corner here. Edge card scenario on the other side of the stage now. Ooh, eats two PK fires right there to get back on stage. Actually, covers, I think that was 15%. That was quite a bit. Yeah. Ooh, but Nesky making Plum pay for it, dude, trying to get back. That's my percent. I want it back. <laughs> Ooh, both side magnet. Hopefully, uh, doesn't throw it out again. Oh, the down smash! Yeah, I really like that option from Nesty, just waiting out the option from Plum. Ooh, sour spot, the sweet spot, okay. I don't know if that was true or if that was just a mix up. Yeah, it's a good question. I don't know either. Beautiful fair. Plum is very good on the spacing of those fairs, as I say that. It's a weak one, but... Competitor's Curse. Another <laughs> one. <laughs> Alright, how's Nesty gonna land? Just avoiding the up tilt back throw? Probably will do it. Or up throw, actually. Ooh, Sorry, yeah. The small battlefield on lower ceiling. And, uh, <laughs> we're at Plum, actually, in the lead now. This yep. game. Alright, and Plum opting to slow it down, as he should. Try and tack on any extra credit that he can. 11%, yeah. not exactly ideal, but we take those. We both shield against each other. All right, pairing the first hit, getting hit by the others. Grab. Oh, oh surprised he didn't grab there. Go for the hard reads. Commentators are trying to read the game, too. Yeah. Oh, goodness <laughs> me. Seems seem like they're... Uh, He's pulling out all the stops on this last uh, stock, on this last game, actually. Oh, not stock yet, but yeah, seems Plum, to be getting close today. Yeah, and Plum was playing a little bit cleaner here. I feel like uh, Nesty's sort of stamina is running out here. Ooh. Hasn't really been able to get much. Oh, interesting, it caught it. Okay. Ooh, oh, that could have been a down air. Oh my goodness, what is going on down here? Oh, Nesty I love that. Nesty makes it back. Goodness me, what, what a recovery. Yeah, what a Holy clever recovery dude. there from Nesty to avoid all that shenanigans. I, I just wanted to see how that played out. Wow. Nesty trying to slow down a little bit now. Uh, likewise, uh, Plum was trying to do that. Yeah, wow. he needs to win a few more neutrals here, attack on some damage. He's one, of, he's one, two, or three now. There we go. Dash attack. Ooh. Gets hit off ledge, though. All right. Trying to avoid a grab or a forward air from Plum is Nesty. All right, a little late on the uh, up B is Father Plum. Almost got the up B as well. Good, good, pretty funny up B kill for Plum. That's good. And, uh, stock there. All right. Plum holding out there. Oh, up tilt not going to connect. Ooh. And Nesty has now brought this back. Plum can't see the dip in. The kill here. That's oh, it. Oh, wow. <coughs> wow. Nesty, bring this game back in his favor. Absolutely. Nesty's <laughs> turn to get a little bit of extra credit here. Plum tried to do the walk up forwarder. Didn't uh, quite work. There we go. Down B hitting the, the approach. 
Wow, that didn't catch. I'm surprised that didn't catch actually. That didn't two frame it at all. Messi's got all the momentum here. Got it back though. Okay. As I say that, the momentum's like gone, but that's okay. What makes it? All right, both players just throwing moves out here. <laughs> Trading jabs, I like it. All right, Plum fighting to get out of the corner. Zero loops, I don't think will work at this percent anymore. I could be wrong. All right, both players just again feeling each other out. Such a close game, 10% difference. <laughs> I'm, I love that interaction so much. The, the two side magnets. Yeah. They both think they're going to throw projectiles. So this is uh, quite the... Uh, All right. Someone's got to read a PK fire here and get a uh, get a punish on it. Ooh, speaking of punishing, the beautiful Zare to punish the side magnet. Right. right. Plum there. Ooh, there and a shield doesn't quite catch him. All right, the synchronized PK fires. Oh, last little bits of forward air. Edge guard scenario. Back there will do it. No, it won't. Oh, I lied. Oh, uh -huh. Commentators. Uh, who curse? I don't know what the what they would call that. <laughs> Commentator's blessing, I guess. Yes, I, th I think so. I was he just blessed Plumbie here with another chance. And oh, that'll do takes it. it off, takes it off best team. Wow. What? Wow. What a set crazy. That was crazy. That's why I'm here. <laughs>